Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Sophia and this is The Handbag's Tale. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any more of my videos. Um, sorry for the way I look today. I'm not feeling the best, but I have got some stuff in the mail so I wanted to go ahead and do an unboxing for you guys. Um, so I'll go over everything whenever I get into it. So the first thing I have is from Amazon. Um, I ordered this on <coughs> Wednesday, I think, and I got it today, which is Friday. So it just came in a um, envelope, or not envelope, it's like a plastic bag. So there's a little thing right here that says lift. So I'm just going to open that like this. And pull this out. So. This is what it looks like. It's like pink, pink cheetah print. It's a toiletry bag. Um, I'm going to a camp, um, hopefully in a few days for work. So I got this toiletry bag so that I can put all my stuff in it whenever I need to. So it's a Norway. So it opens up like this. Kind of, it's smaller than I expected it to be, but it opens up like this, and it's got the inside right here with some pockets. It's got the pockets on the back and the pockets on the side, and then this has like a hanger with some extra pockets right here, and it's got an extra pocket right here, and then it zips, it zips all the way around, okay technical difficulties there we go and then so it sits like this it's also got these two side pockets that unzip and open for extra storage and that's what I really one of the things I really liked about it was that it had extra storage it's got an extra pocket here and this pocket opens up here so yeah oh it's got an extra pocket over here too so hopefully I'll get to go to camp if I feel better and I'll be able to use my new toiletries bag. It was too, it wasn't that expensive either. It was like I think with tax and everything it was seventeen dollars, so not too bad. I gotta take my glasses off. They're giving me a headache right now. Alright, so that's unboxing number one. The Norway. Let me show you guys. Oh, okay. Well that came off. It's Norway. And let me see. <clears throat> they have a lot of options. Duffel bags, toiletry bags, makeup bags, cosmetic bags, and travel makeup bags. So, I got it off Amazon. I can leave the link in the description box down below in case you guys want to go check them out. So, that's unboxing number one. I'm just going to set this off to the side. And then, this is unboxing number two. So, this is not from Amazon. This is from Poshmark. So let me make sure her address is on. Yeah, so it came in an Amazon Basics box, but um, it's not from Amazon. It's from Poshmark, and it's a bag, of course. Um, I ordered this last Friday, or, yeah, no, I ordered this on Monday, and it got here today, so I'm pretty excited. And there's a backstory to this bag, so I'll tell y'all what it is when I get into it. So here's, I open the inside of the box and she stuffed it pretty well for me. So she's got it all wrapped up. I'm gonna put this down here. So she's got this paper, tissue paper, tissue paper, tissue paper, and here is the bag. So it's very soft. I think she may have cleaned it or it was in someone's closet or something because it's got a weird smell to it but it's like soft really soft so here it is it's a Margot New York backpack so it's got this front pocket with the little button here it's got that and open it up like this it's got pretty roomy the whole length of the bag um, and then here's the back. It's got um, just some straps that are 
sewn in here and then adjustable at the bottom there and right there it's got the back and then the top handle here and then it's got this long zipper pull and it zips all the way around and then there's the inside so there's a slip pocket here and a zipper pocket here there's the zipper pocket and then just an empty big backpack, I mean a big cavern, you know, like you expect in a backpack. So, it feels kind of sticky. I might need to, maybe she cleaned it with something. I don't know. I need, I have leather cleaner <clears throat> and stuff that I use on my Louis Vuitton bag. So, I might just rub it down or something to get the stickiness off of it. Um, but, yeah. So, backstory of this bag. So, this bag is made by the Margot company M A R G O T they still make this backpack but I was watching Extreme Sisters and let me get my phone so that I tell you the right name oh I'm filming on my phone duh geez Louise um it was one of the sisters I think it was her name's Jess Jessica or Christina um I'm not for sure which one, but they had this backpack. They were wearing this backpack in the, the episode of the show, and I fell in love with it. The way she was wearing it, um, <clears throat> it just looked wonderful. So I looked and looked and looked. I couldn't find it. On the episode, you couldn't really tell the brand because it's like really small, like embossed right there. And the, the episode, I couldn't ever figure out what brand it was. So I looked and looked. I couldn't find it. So I was like, you know what, it's a long shot, but I will message her and ask her about her backpack. So I messaged her, I found her on Instagram, I messaged her, I had no intentions of her like responding to me ever, um, but she did and she told me the name of the, the, the bag, she told me where she had gotten it from um, and I was so thankful because if you've ever like seen a bag that you don't know what it is or the brand of it you just and you can't find it like it's irritating for me at least um hopefully I'm not the only one that's that way but I couldn't find it and so when she told me the name of it and she told me where she got it from I was so excited so she got it from Marshalls and it's Margot so I found it online they still sell the backpack um but I looked in Marshalls to see I looked in TJ Maxx um, just kind of casually I didn't find it so I found it for sale on because I mean I don't mind paying full price for it but if I can get it for cheaper like obviously that's what I'm gonna do so I found it on Poshmark this lady was selling it and she had it for sale for $80 and I was like that's good because it's normally 150 like 150 plus shipping all that so it's about half off so I waited and waited and waited and then um, on Sunday night I think I looked and I saw that she had it marked down to 65 and I was like oh that's even better so I messaged like I offered 50 for it and she accepted so got it for a third of the price and I mean even though it's used I don't care about used bags if they're in good condition and other than like the stickiness and it's only on the front I, I feel like she wiped it down with something because the back's not sticky the bottom's not sticky it's just this front um, but other than that, I mean, it smells like kind of old, like, it's going to sound mean, but like old person. I don't know. That's the best way I can describe it. Like old, per like old lady perfume kind of, but I mean, I can work with that. So, but yeah, I mean, it's in really good condition. So, yeah. So this is my backpack and my back story. I'm so excited to have it. And I would not have it without the help of that lady on Extreme Sisters. I think it was Jess. I think it was Jess, maybe. But I'm not sure. Anyway, so that's all for today. Um, my unboxings, um, my two new bags. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.